Fred Marshall, Kathy McDonald leading the horses postward for race number two this evening's second race, claiming handicap trotters, racing one mile. A purse of $2,000, no changes in this field of 10. Number one is Bombs Express, owned by Jimmy Lewis and Herman Kinder of Troy. Jim Lewis drives. Two is Continental Chief, owned by Sal Nasura and Richard Stevens of Columbus with Michael Wilder. Three, Wildwood General, owned by Roy Murphy of Solana with Randy Tharps. Four's Diamonds Double, owned by John Busey of Somerset, Jeff Founderboard. Number five, Shawlon Major, owned by Mac Davis of Zanesville for Dave Hawk. Six is Brooklyn Miss, owned by Louis Edward May and Terry May of Ohio, Brian Weaver drives. Seven is Desert Glory, leased by Chris McGuire with Brad Hanners aboard. Number eight, Mick One, owned by Margaret Geisinger of Newark, John Hostetler drives. Nine is Lucky Blaze, owned by William Sokoloff of Coral Springs, Florida Mel Turk out of the bike. And the ten, Stock Hill, owned and driven by Alan Anderson of Richwood. When play show perfect to pick three weeks ago. They're off and uh, trotting and first off the rail, it's Bob's Express from the outside. It's Shawlan Major and two horses between Diamonds a Double. And now back into the wood comes Wildwood General. He's trotting fourth. Moving through nicely, five star kill of the outside and trotting uh, sixth, it's Mick One. Along the rail and racing a seventh, Continental Chief. Early eighth is Desert Glory. Then it's two lengths ninth to Lucky Blaze, the uh, Triller tenth. As they reach the first quarter, at Brooklyn Miss. They're at the first stop, 29 and 2. And on the outside, Shawlan Major will now take the lead. Diamonds double on the inside, trotting second. Bob's Express along the rail is third. Here comes Mick One. He's continuing to be parked to the outside, but he's moving forward quickly, racing fourth. Inside five to Wildwood General. Along the rail, sixth to Stalk Hill, racing a seventh Continental Chief, followed by Desert Glory. Into the clubhouse, turn they go. There's nine on the wood, one moving, and the leader continues to be Shawlan Major as he leads by two lengths. Mick One is now there at the leader's wheel, pressuring second, half at one minute and two fifth, and Mick One is off stride as they straighten out down the backstretch. Shawlan Major continue to lead now by two and a half, three lengths. Diamonds double on the inside, trotting a second. Here comes Stalk Hill getting it away on the outside with a quick rush. Now third, Bombs Express on the inside, trotting a fourth. Continental Chief, gap in the cover badly, is trotting fifth. Alongside a sixth, it's Wildwood General. Racing a seventh, Desert Glory, as they reach the three-quarter mile marker. It's heavily favored Shawlan Major. Still on the front end, three quarters, 131 and four, but at the leader's wheel now comes Stalk Hill. He's pressuring heavily too, and Diamonds Double is right there, trotting a third, then it's a gap of five to Bombs Express as they turn for home, and Shawlan Major is off stride, turning for home, and that leaves Stalk Hill to inherit the lead, and Stalk Hill quickly taking advantage here, opens up by four, Shawlan Major catching quickly, right back trotting, Diamonds Double to the outside, but it's Stalk Hill in front. Tight for place. Finishing his second number five, Shawlan Major. Third number four, Diamonds Double. Uh, the inquiry does involve the unofficial place horse. Place hold all tickets. Inquiry does not involve the unofficial winner. He's trackside now in the winner's circle. Number 10 is Stalk Hill, a nine-year-old son of Corn Stalk from Sorcery Hill by Egyptian Candor. Own trained and nicely handled tonight by Ellen Anderson of Richwood, Ohio. His first season's victory. Trotting the mile in 202 four fifths. Second race trophy presentation by Amos Lanes. Eighty tonight's daily double seven ten forty three dollars even. 